Robert Bakula came to the Mayo Clinic after his doctor in Wisconsin suggested he get a second opinion, a second opinion involving this 64-slice computed tomography system, considered the latest generation CT scanner. This scanner is going to improve the amount and quality of information we can uh, provide physicians about their patients. We're going to be able to address certain questions that we haven't addressed before. And in many circumstances, we'll be able to provide more detailed information, more detailed images that we haven't generated with the same amount of resolution previously. The Mayo Clinic was the first medical facility in the country to use the Somatome Sensation 64. It's since been installed at more than 150 locations nationwide. There are many other physicians, particularly surgeons, who can now look at the human anatomy like a Gray's anatomy and I can see the disease or the structure or the function in a three-dimensional mode and then plan my surgery or my treatment. And because of the speed of the detector spinning around the patient, the exam itself can be performed in just seconds. This means better images can be captured of moving structures like the heart and patients like Robert only have to lie still and hold their breaths for a few seconds. These exams now we can take a very fast scan, 10-15 seconds of breath hold, and see very, very tiny details. That lets the doctor go in and work with the data in, in three dimensions and look at basically everything from the skin in and find out what it is they need to answer to, um, to solve the medical problem. And even the patients are impressed with this technology. Well, the pictures I saw in the video one there are really fantastic. This technology is providing doctors with the information they need in greater detail than ever before, leading to improved diagnosis and better patient care. This is Mike Morris.